just on command, this beautiful bird here flying to its trainer. This is at the Cascades Raptor Center. Around 50 raptors currently live at the Raptor Center and you can enjoy them. You can learn all about them at Family Nature Discovery Day. It's happening this weekend and joining me live right now is Kit Lacey, Education Director. And we also have our star of the show, I'm sorry, it is Dimitri. <laughs> That's right, Dimitri always shines wherever he goes. <laughs> what kind of owl is Dimitri and what can Dimitri do? Well, Dimitri is a Eurasian eagle owl. So eagle in the raptor world just means really big owl. So this is one of the largest owl species in the world. I believe it. He's pretty, he's, he's really big. Me, like what is up with you? That's right. <laughs> So Dimitri is one of our avian ambassadors at our center. Um, and you know, Dimitri loves to meet guests. He travels off site, loves to be in the studio I here he with does. us too. <laughs> um, and so, you know, Dimitri is just one of our birds that is working for wildlife at the Cascades Raptor Center. And when this particular event, which is happening this weekend, yeah. we will be bringing out some of the birds so the That's kids can true. really have a chance to interact, see them eat what they do. That's right, exactly. So, um, you know, a lot of our trainers will be there, and so birds will be out. There'll be training sessions. So, even some of the birds that um, just do having training sessions in their aviary. So, you know, might be seeing some birds moving around, flying. Um, you know, doing what birds do uh, at the center um, on sun now, on D Sunday. Dimitri isn't one of the injured birds that have been there for a long time. But the neat thing is that the, the Oregon, the, this Cascades Raptor Center, has brought in some birds that have been injured really gave them a second lease on life in a way. That's right. So our resident birds are an amazing group of individual animals. Um, and, you know, they all have different stories. And some of them are birds that were wild hatched, um, did have injuries, and were non-releasable. And now they are ambassadors for their species. So, and they do a great job at it. And like I said, it takes a really special bird. I mean, here's Dimitri sitting in the studio wild, with like us. Calm. Yep, really confident, um, and that's really important for us, too, um, that these guys are great at their jobs. And I think it's so wonderful that we, as the public, you invited, you're, it's open for us to enjoy, to see close up these that's birds. Right. To, and you can be really, really close, you can, like almost as close as I, I am I right know, now. you're <laughs> basically nose to beak with Dimitri here today. And, oh. um, you know, it is really awesome to see these animals up close and personal. Mm. And when you do, I think you don't look at wildlife the same way again. Mm -hmm. You start noticing out there in your neighborhood, in your community, maybe even in your own backyard, and your appreciation for wildlife, I think, really goes just through wow. the roof. It's really exciting. I'm really appreciating this right now. <laughs> Melissa, this is an amazing event, and uh, it's happening this weekend. There it is, Sunday, August the 31st from 12 p.m. until 4 p.m., and you'll find more information on our website.